Hello everyone, today we are trying to prepare or make the third tutorial about the MATLAB program. In the beginning, I'm trying to show you what I'm gonna explain in this tutorial. For instance, we have a, a different value of PWF, a pressure, okay? And we are trying to find the value of QO, flow rate, I mean, in a different value of pressure. For example, if the pressure the our uh, the pressure is bigger than this value the pv find for me by using this uh, formula otherwise if it is uh, greater than this value use this formula for me okay in this tutorial i am trying to explain how we can do this and then uh, we can make the plot for our calculation okay so let's start and I'm trying to use a simple uh, formula then depends on the calculation which you have you can use your own formula okay so let's start in the beginning I'm trying to create a statement for example a equal to to b equal to uh, 3 and c I'm using the just a simple uh, equations of formula sorry equal to uh, four okay then for example I, I want to find the value of w to a plus b minus c this is the first one the second one w equal to uh, three a minus whatever you like and depends on your calculation now I am writing whatever I want minus B plus 3 C okay for example if I want to find the value of W if I want to use this one okay I am trying to give the command to mathcat to find the value of W for this one either using this one okay how we can do this for example i'm writing a, a, a okay then you should write the value the name of the function for example here we have w equal to after that this is important how many equations you have for example now you have only two okay it's, it's okay if you have two three four okay you should add one line more for example this is we have two equation you should add three line okay then what uh, uh what we are trying to find and sorry before that you should define all these values which you have in the function we have a b and b and c okay and here the name of the function which we have we should write it and then we should write this one this is a local definition okay and then write the formula copy and paste here you can give the statement or the command by using if okay use this one for example if the value I'm trying to change um, a okay if the value of a is bigger than 10 okay so it means uh, find the value of w for me if the value of a bigger than 10 okay then the next one I'm writing uh, I'm copying this one the next formula to here okay here we don't need another if uh, uh, now we have only two formula okay if the value of the a is greater than 10 automatically uh, the math cat is using the it will use this one to find the value of w otherwise at any value of a use this 
formula okay so then just otherwise then write the w again here now we just we have created the the formula now if you want to find the value of w depends on this uh, command how we can find it? if we we write any value which is greater than 10 automatically the mathcad is going to use the first formula to find the value of w if we are trying to find the value of w if the value of a equal to 11 so for a equal to is equal to 21 by using the first formula okay if we write the same formula but the value is if the value of a is smaller than 10 for example 5 it's gonna use the second one okay now i think it's clear and one more thing if you are trying to make the graph for our common how we can do it you should delete this uh, because you are you should give uh, the command some values and delete this one okay it, de it depends on the value of a i mean okay let's and let's try to give the interval increment i mean we can use this one for for giving the interval to our values okay for example the our the a values let's start from 0 to for example to 50 okay and now if you want to if you write the a automatically it will give you all the value of a and one more thing is important as well if if you have the increment you can add it for here for example uh, you can use for example 0 to 5 then the value it will, it's gonna change like this for example the increment will be 5 0 5 until 50 okay this is important then we are trying to create the graph for our value here we are you should copy this literally or you should write by yourself the plot will be versus a and let me explain how the mathcad is create this graph for us see the increment uh, the interval is 0 to 50 and it takes some values from uh, uh, the increment is 5 and the interval is 50 okay see if we analyze the uh, if we analyze the graph we are be able to see the difference see the value which is less than or smaller than 10 the uh, the math guide is using this one uh, to find the value of w see that you can see the difference here and then once the value of the uh, a will be bigger than 10 instantly the the equation for finding the w is gonna change here right so now uh, i think everything is clear